Welcome to our Angular Deep Dive. Today, we're tackling an interesting question from one of our viewers about inversion of control, or IOC, in Angular. Specifically, they want to know how to use an interface called Map Service with two different implementations, Google Map Service and Leaflet Map Service. The goal is to allow Angular to choose the right implementation without developers having to specify which one to use. Let's break this down and explore how we can achieve this seamless integration. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me and hopefully you get through that resolution. So let's continue on. To implement inversion of control in Angular, we will start by defining our interface, map service. This interface will outline the methods that any map service implementation must provide. Next, we will create two classes that implement this interface, Google Maps Service and Leaflet Map Service. Each class will provide its own implementation of the methods defined in the Map Service interface. Now, in our component, we want to use the Map Service interface as the type for our service. This allows us to depend on the abstraction rather than a specific implementation. To dynamically choose between implementations, we can use Angular's dependency injection system. We can provide the desired implementation in the provider's array of our component or module. Finally, by using this approach, we can easily switch between different map service implementations without changing the component code, adhering to the principles of inversion of control. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To implement inversion of control in Angular, consider using an abstract class instead of an interface. Create an abstract class for your service and then implement it in your specific service. In your component, provide the service using the abstract class and specify which implementation to use. Finally, inject the service into your component's constructor to use it. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To implement inversion of control in Angular, you can specify a provider in the component's providers array. This allows you to use a specific implementation of a service. In this example, the map service is provided using the Google Map Service class. This means that wherever map service is injected, Google Map Service will be used. You can also apply this same provider syntax at the module level, allowing for broader service availability across your application. And that's it guys. We've gone through the solutions and I'm hoping that it resolved your issue. If it did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.